Tamari, welcome back to my channel. First, I just want to mention that my setup literally looks like I'm about to host a new show. Second, it has literally been 10 months since I have spoken in a video, so here's my voice. Welcome back to my channel. And third, I just want to mention that a lot of this stuff is geared towards my personal liking. And it may not seem like a lot, but that's also because I have a lot of stuff that I can reuse from last year. Let's just get started because I keep talking, and yeah. <laughs> so the first items I picked up were these sticky notes. My dad went back to the Philippines this year, actually, and I asked him to pick me up some stationery. So I got a lot of sticky notes. Um, and these three are by the brand Zinsin, and they come in three shapes that I have. Um, it's a strawberry, a star, and an apple. And then for these two right here, I have one that's like a post-it note size and has lines on it, which is awesome if you like to write on lines. And then this one is my favorite because it's just this compact little rectangular sticky note pack. And this one has four colors as well. And I love it so much. And I'm super glad to have all of the sticky notes because for example, I love using the sticky notes in my notes. These were my notes for my oceanography class last year. And um, sometimes you run out of space or if the professor is giving more information that's not on the screen, it definitely helps if you put it on sticky notes and just put it with your notes. The next item that I got was this planner. This I picked up from TJ Maxx. It was only $6 and I know planners can definitely be pricey, but this one is perfect for me. It just says a hello 2018 on it and it's this nice orange coral color. It is split it into two sections. so. It has the calendars in the front, and then when you go in, it has the weekly spreads. So I just really love this planner, and it's also gold on the inside, which is super duper cute. <laughs> now, these next items are from Target, so hopefully if you guys are still going back to school shopping, you can find these as well. So the first item I picked up was this regular white folder, and I think this was like 50 cents or so. I'm going to be putting line paper and homework in here. And the reason why I'm going to be putting line paper in here is because I will be using these notebooks. Um, these were all 50 cents and I picked up five so it was 250 in total but these notebooks are specifically quad ruled or grid ruled or graph ruled whichever one you would like to call it but they look like this and I really like taking notes on this type of paper because I feel like it makes my notes look nicer and helps me write and I'm really into bullet journaling and taking notes in like the online study community. So because I was speaking of graph paper, I just wanted to show you guys some of my notes from last semester in the spring. So as you all can tell, those are my notes. I really like writing on graph paper. And the next item I have is the seven pocket organizer. These came in three colors, gray, black, and dark forest green. So I just picked up the gray one. And I really love using these because these help me stay organized. Um, and this one is especially cool because it can just slide into your backpack and you can open it like that. I used to have the one that opened horizontally. So this one definitely helps, especially if there's a class right after yours and you just need to go because a lot of the people in my case love to just walk in even though there's still people in there so yeah the next item that i picked up from target was this four pack of big whiteout correction tape and my sister and i love to use these so i'm going to split these with her but what's really awesome as well is that i've never seen it in yellow and like this red pink color so hopefully i can cop those two <laughs> Now I know what you guys are going to say, Mari, you literally showed us five packs of sticky notes, why do you have another one? But literally I cannot pass these up, these are only a dollar from the dollar section and they come in these cute little fruit shapes and you can actually use these as page flags as well. I still need to pick up some post-it page flags just because even though these are cute, um, will I actually end up using them? Who knows? And the last item that I picked up from Target because I explained to you guys that I love studying and bullet journaling, I picked up these Stedler Tri Plus Fine Liners, the 10 pack in the 0.3 millimeter tip. And these are so, so nice. Like you guys, I sampled these and these are so pretty and easy to write with. And what's really cool about this case is that you can just prop it open like this. And especially when you're studying and don't wanna make too much noise or if you just like wanna constantly study, you can just prop this up and then slip these out and use them and these will definitely be helpful like in a cafe like Starbucks 
or in the library. Um, my library has two levels and the second level is specifically for quiet studying. So this will definitely come in handy when I study there. Um, also, it's like if you breathe up there, that's too loud. So, <laughs> so these last few items are definitely um, stationary oriented, especially if you really like taking notes or bullet journaling, then these will definitely be stable items that you will see on Instagram or on YouTube. The first item that I picked up was this Westcott ruler. It's just a six inch one. This definitely helps, especially when you are outlining or if you want to make boxes and kind of square in information and format your papers or spreads, this is definitely useful. The next item that I picked up, this I literally love these so much. These are the Pilot Friction Highlighters and they are beautiful soft pastel colors. So if you're looking for soft pastel highlighters, these I feel like are the perfect one. These are also erasable, so if you accidentally go too far highlighting, you can just erase it as well. And I just love these so much. Now you know I couldn't do a back to school haul plus stationery haul if I did not have mild liners. And I know I got the same colors as my Pilot Friction highlighters, but that's also because I wanted to see um, the comparison but the other pro about this one is that it has two tips. One is for highlighting and the other one you can actually like do your headers with. So here's the highlighting side and then here's the actual marker tip side. And personally, I really like the Pilot Friction highlighters more, but these work just as well. So yeah. Now the last thing in my back to school haul is the item that I was most excited for actually. And it is my Lit Lab pen case in the brown color. It also comes in black orange, green, and more other colors, um, but I decided to pick up the brown one, and I'm not going to open it because I want to save that for a what's in my pen case video, so it is just super cute, it looks like this, and it has two pockets in the front as well, and I will get more in depth with my video, and so yeah. So that is it for my back to school supplies slash stationery haul, um, I really hope you guys enjoyed, I know again that this may seem sparse to some of you, but again, I keep saying again, I kind of know what works for me, so I don't want to splurge on items that I don't need. And also, I just wanted to mention that I've had this channel since my sophomore year of high school, and I'm going to be a sophomore in college, so that is just a long way. So even though I have a little amount of subscribers, thank you all for sticking around with me. Um, and if you're just visiting, thank you for watching this video. I hope you subscribe or come back to visit when I have more back to school videos. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, you guys can follow me on social media if you want. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!